many people over here are wondering what day is this, what is this, is this a birthday party or what is it? It's only a get together. Uh, I just wanted all of my friends, family, associates and uh, my team who's been working with me uh, to come together which has been exciting for a very very long time. So I thought today is the day um, and this is the year to do that <laughs> because Last year was not great news for me and uh, there were a lot of ups and downs which happens in everybody's life. But what happened last year actually brought all of you together to me because uh, each one of you has made a silent prayer for me and which has resurrected me actually, <laughs> uh, given me a second chance and helped me to come out free. <laughs> So I felt I have to thank all of you, each one of you, um, starting with my own family, um, especially Muthu. He was very tensed, but he has been he's been there with me, you know, running around. Me. But I think it was a three months or four month ordeal. But at the end of it, um, everybody came together. That was the best part. Um, each one of them. Um, sent me their prayers. They did their own prayers at home, uh, which I didn't know and they mentioned later. And my own gurus who just came running and stayed with me in my house for 10 to 15 days and ensured that I'm out of this. Uh, I know that I'm a fighter, but I kind of gave up last year. But uh, with all of your support, uh, it was phenomenal that I have gained a lot of energy and I'm able to fight it back. Um, my father, as usual, very motivational, <laughs> helped me to look at life very differently. And um, all of my very close friends who did not give up on me. And uh, <laughs> Nyanam Pati over here, she's like a mother to me. And uh, she would always say all positive things. She would say, you know, everything will be perfect for you, just don't worry. And uh, also all of my associates like Mr. Mani Koza and uh, Mr. Babu, uh, they were supporting me, you know, they are like, okay, we'll do your job, you go, <laughs> you know, you take care of yourself. And uh, my team, you know, there's Noor and Ravanchal here today, but uh, they would be like, okay, ma'am, we'll take care of everything, you just tell us what to do. So somehow, my work was also happening and uh, certain quarters from which I didn't expect to, so like my clients who, uh, who prayed for me, you know, so I, I was feeling very grateful then itself and I thought I should just call over people home and have a small lunch get together. But uh, it so happened that there were too many people and that's why we arranged it here and a big thank you to uh, she has arranged this place for me and she's uh, supported me and constantly calling me everything done, is this done, I will I'll do work for you and really hats off to you now for being here with me. And also uh, all of my spiritual friends, we have our own group, so uh, they were also very encouraging uh, and they would say no, there is more that you have to do in life, so we need you here. <laughs> so with all that encouragement and with all your blessings, I see in each one of you that God is there and God has come to help me. So thank you, thank you for being here. Um, a heartfelt gratitude to you. That's the only reason why this program has happened. Along with it, my support staff at home, uh, my driver Mahadev, his family, and Ramanji, Shanti and all of them, they have all just been there to help me fight this and they had tears in their eyes. <laughs> so all that love that I have received, I feel so grateful. Thank you. Thanks so much. So be
behind every successful woman, there is a man. <laughs> Good afternoon all and loving you all. Uh, as JT was telling, uh, last year was very tough for us. Yep. Challenging. You all know that. In fact, uh, three of our immediate family, uh, we had life-threatening issues. Not a simple thing, so it was so tough for us. But since the support from all of you, 100% faith in God, uh, which helped us. Uh, you know, and uh, the faith was unshakable, and uh, we know we would come out. But uh, you know, sometimes there were some doubts. Why us? Even that, we stopped questioning God. And uh, in fact, JT had a huge support from Puna Uncle, uh, Aya. You know, they were the pillars. You can say. In fact, uh, I was like you know a little shaken up initially, but then later on I realized that it is really supporting her. The whole system, how it worked for her, I am 100%, it is all because of the divine intervention uh, this has happened. And uh, thanks for coming today and uh, I think our uh, relationship with all of you is going to be long term and uh, we are looking forward to it. And uh, thank you again. And I'm amazing how JD took all the responsibilities, we didn't find any vacuum at home. In fact, we were equally demanding in the Sapar Sarila, in the Sarila, everything was sorted out, kind of a thing. Maybe initially one or two months, yeah, she was not able to, but managing home and work and Vishnu, and, and in fact, uh, constructing my factory where I was like very demanding in that also. So she could uh, manage everything and uh, successfully come out of it. And I'm grateful to God and all of you. Thank you. God, if I'm seeing you with Shankar uncle because he's going to decide my fate, you know. So, um, so Shankar uncle was there with me throughout. I really thank him from the bottom of my heart. And also Muthu's sister and mother who, who have additionally prayed. And uh, we have been to all the temples that they have prayed to. And many thanks to them. Uh, and likewise, uh, everybody else over here. After that, my life has changed. I become more aware of why I am living and what I should be doing in the future. So a lot of lifestyle changes and also thought changes that are happening, uh, it's kind of, I'm more clear where I'm going. So even if I have one or two years or even if I have 10 years or even if I have 30 years of life, I know what I want to do. So at least that I'm clear about. And I know that I'm not going to just sit and only family, family. <laughs> <laughs> and as of now, by God's grace, I don't know what God planned, my son is off to hostel and so I have more time to do my service, which I always wanted to do. So I'm going to be moving into that. It's a new chapter, it's a new Jayanti from now on. Thank you. 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 Thank